we were granted by the new administration a community development fund each month to do, to do projects within our respective constituencies. And the first thing that came to my mind when I heard this was that we need to have a park in honor and tribute to this legend and this icon of Kelly Street, Mr. Program. I recall quite vividly the night before his untimely passing, spending the last few hours with him. It was like he was on a spiritual high that I've never seen before. Anywhere you went across this country, you would see Mr. Program pushing his music because he believed in himself. And that is the type of belief that we want our young artists to have in themselves. And we want politicians to have in these young artists the same type of belief and to invest in them. And likewise, the community that they hail from. Today we celebrate and honor our dearly departed friend, Gilbert Mr. Program Alamia. Through the dedication of this multifunctional space, made possible through the efforts of our hardworking minister and Caribbean Shores Rep, Honorable Karim Musa, tragedy struck our hearts on October 2nd, 2021, if I can recall, as we heard of Mr. Program's untimely and unfortunate um, passing. Uh, I'm certain a storm of grief stationed itself over this community. Um, as a matter of fact, the entire city, and of course the entertainment sector, as we prepare to bid our final farewells. On that very day, in the wee hours of the morning, this country lost a budding icon. And in his honor, we are gathered to lead the Inspirational Foundation Minister for the development of numerous icons.